Why is this humble windmill such a great view? I mean, it's understandable. It must have been a long time since you last came to Mondstadt. Because it is the true Great Vayu Viastra? <sighs> oh, come on. Don't tell me you don't get it. Vyu, Vayu, and also Mahamatra, Vayu Viastra? No? Kanari! Sino! Over here! Whew, am I glad to see you. And who's this young lady? Master, this is Sucrose, an alchemist with the Knights of Favonius. We just met. Sucrose, this is my teacher, Tainari. He's a highly respected forest watcher in Sumeru, and he's also a very famous botanist. Kale's exaggerating. I'm Tainari. Pleased to meet you. <sighs> so you have a teacher as well. The pleasure is all mine, Tainari, sir. Yep. He's extremely knowledgeable, too. And this is General Mahamatra Sino of the Sumeru Academia. He's really famous in Sumeru as well. Greetings. Though if I might say so, we're purely here for personal reasons. You needn't be unduly concerned with our official positions. And Kale, there's no need to use my full title. Sino is fine. Or sir, if you absolutely must. Indeed. We're not here in an official capacity, just to keep Kale company on her vacation. Keep me company? But it was you two that insisted on coming! Kale is very important to us. We felt obliged to ensure her safety on the long, treacherous journey to Mondstadt. But I've been here on my own loads of times before! What about your work, though? What if something bad happens while the General Mahamatra's away? There should be no issues. I have left my duties in the hands of my subordinates, and two especially reliable helpers. Oh, Sucrose! What were you saying about you having a teacher as well? I was just going to mention that... I think we're in a somewhat similar situation. I'm an assistant to Mr. Albedo, Mondstadt's genius alchemist. Oh. Please, Sucrose. Genius is an unnecessary epithet. It will serve only to leave an exaggerated impression of me in the minds of our guests. M Mr. Albedo, but it is an objective truth. Hey, Albedo's here too! Great! The more the merrier! Hmm. So tell me, Sucrose. Since your specialty is bioalchemy, what do you know about the anti-toxic properties of the calla lily? Wait, wait! Can we hold off on the nerdy topic for now? Pilot doesn't want to be left out! Oh, as it happens, I've studied the calla lily in quite some detail before, with it being a species native to Mondstadt. I wrote a whole report on my findings. If you're interested, Mr. Tainari, sir, I can go get it for you. <sighs> We're supposed to be here on vacation, and you're already thinking about how to improve your herbal medicines? Also, I thought we'd agreed to take on new identities for this trip. What new identities? Mine was Adventurer Sino, skilled desert explorer. Tainari's was technological consultant to the treasure hoarders, and Kale's was traveling musician. Very much so. I do wish some of the less cautious adventurers in the Avidya Forest would consider coming to Mondstadt instead. What Philanimo mushrooms lack in texture, they make up for in not causing vomiting or diarrhea. <laughs> Are you contemplating using some compounds from the calla lily as active ingredients in a targeted antidote? Yes, I gathered a few on the way here, and my initial research suggests to me that it could be worth a try. Okay. I got it. But as much as I don't wish to be a wet blanket, it takes a huge amount of experimental data to conclusively prove how different drugs interact. Estimating the total development time would be very difficult. Add in the time for procurement and delivery of essential materials, and I'm not sure if we could complete development before you need to return.
Then please, allow me to help. Mr. Albedo! Apologies for my tardy entrance in the present discussion. I understand you're looking to make an antidote for poisonous fungi, correct? If you happen to have some samples with you, or relevant documentation on hand, perhaps you might give me the chance to review them later. But before that, I invite the three of you to look at this. Food and lodging arrangements? Were you quietly writing this up the whole time? Pylon didn't even notice! Hardly. Rather, I should apologize for interrupting a serious discussion between trained professionals, especially after they've traveled so far to be here, when I myself am neither an adventurer, nor a technological consultant, nor a musician. Nevertheless, I would encourage you to have a knowledgeable local arrange your detailed itinerary while you're in Mondstadt. Take a look, and should you find anything here to be objectionable, it can easily be adjusted. This is too kind of you. These arrangements are quite excellent. It looks great! Even Paimon feels like tagging along for the food and board! That's why it's called tagging along! Very comprehensive. The adventurer, technological consultant, and musician I'll approve. Thank you. Just one thing. We'd like the chance to cook as well. Why don't we change the group dinner to a camping and cooking trip? I'll help pitch the tents! I can help too. Um, and Paimon will take him to Good Hunter to order some starters. Mom's dad's cold cut platter is not to be missed. Great, then it's decided. Sucrose and I will bring the three of you to your inn for a quick rest. You two, let's meet by the lake this evening.